kind of game is it? Is it an official one? I mean, I you that isn't something I do like the whole series of, but I did do a uh, I did do a security breach on the channel. Like I could consider doing something like that. Why was this gold? Why why was this gold? What? Why is this important? But yeah, it is but they made a game on. Okay, because I thought it sounded familiar. It's a point and click adventure, kind of. Huh. Well, sounds like the thing that I'll probably look up on YouTube but not play myself then actually. This is what's probably going on here. Find and kill Atos the Beast Caller. That's for some other DLC quest. Well, he's right here anyway. Screw it, I'll do it. I just kind of want to see what was going on here. Yeah, I'll look it up out of curiosity. This is what I will do. Ow. All right, safety sake. Yeah, even it's my kick buttons. Maybe I can set it up so that these scripts will also keep track of like when I've switched my uh, control, not my control scheme there. What things are my active things. Like I could probably program it so that if I press the buttons to switch, it no longer does the kick sound effect. And then when I switch back, then it does. It. Like that's what turns it on and off. I'm sure I could do that. Die. I can just barely kick. Okay, I mean, uh, like an 8-bit game. Oh, okay. Something like that. Um, I do actually think I can win. As long as nobody else is a mercenary nearby that wants to kill me. As long as that's the case. Yeah, one of the pixelated things got like the mini games of the earlier games then, right? Or even later games? I don't know. How long did they do those for? I don't remember. Oh my god. Decent while, at least. I remember it was being done for. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. <laughs> okay. Gotta go. I was waiting on our brother to continue the game in his back, so we gotta go. Oh, okay, talk to that Grispa. Rest complete. Athos the Beast Caller. I had no idea I even had that quest. I didn't even get any XP for it. Like, what? I don't know why I just did that. Yeah, I gotcha. I got you there. To play through it together. Whee! Away we go. But yeah, I appreciate that there, Guzma. Also, once I start getting underway with some more of these quests, maybe when I start episode three, I was just talking earlier in the stream about how uh, if I want something to ramble about at some point, maybe one of these days, screw this guy in particular. I'll just ramble about the story of Last of Us Part 2. Somehow I could ramble about these few things. So, like, if there isn't any other conversations that end up coming up, like, maybe that's something that I would end up rambling about later on if I want something to talk about to fill the void of other stuff going on here. That's what I might do. But I don't need to yet. Don't need to at the moment. And there's also some other stuff that I could talk about. Like, the updates on the truck situation. I can probably do that right now, as a matter of fact. So... I kind of hope to take the Fragapalooza like I did last year and then sleep in the back in a tent considering the way that my car heats up like a furnace in the mornings as sun starts coming in. And I did seem to manage to get it on the road. I was dealing with carburetor issues for nine months. Fixed that. And then the fuel pump started having issues. A lot of issues. Um, here we go. And then fixed that. And it just wasn't working from there anymore, for some reason. Not entirely sure why, at the time. And then, neighbor helped me out, who works as a mechanic. And he pulled the spark plugs, and we cleaned them with a torch. Because, like, in all my attempts to start it and failing, I basically got, like, a whole bunch of fuel built up in those spark plugs that was, like, stuck in there. Oh my goodness. So, I don't need to open the order of the Ancients menu. Here, just do this. And then it started working, and I was like, oh, great, it's working. And one of the things that my dad suggested that I do... Okay, it is marked as my objective here still. Wait, did I get a whole bunch of money from that one quest anyway, killing that guy? Oh, I made back my... No, I didn't. I saw that as, like, an extra digit. So, it was working, and my dad suggested, like, hey, maybe it should be filled up with, like, some more premium fuel that might help. Help it run a little bit better while it's in this phase that's struggling and help mix in some cleaner that we had put in there. Because I hadn't filled it up at all since it had broken down last year. 
Like, I still had half a tank because I was using it so infrequently. What with the issues I was having with it. It's not like I was driving it around all that regularly. So I still had half a tank from when I filled up last September for the last time. I mean, with fuel stabilizer in it, so it wouldn't go bad because it leave fuel for a long time. It will go bad. So it should still have been fine fuel, but make some premium stuff in there. That's why I figured. So I drove it out. I, I, when I was going over to my uncle's place for just a visit when family was visiting here recently, like the, uh, my mom's cousin from Germany, who I was talking about earlier, we, uh, I brought the truck over there, drove my parents in that and it worked just fine. Started it up and drove it home, took it through the rain, and it worked okay. The windshield wipers were actually working surprisingly well. And then the following day is when it was like, all right, yeah, let's take it to the gas station. And I had some errands to run. So I pulled into a gas station by a shopper's drug mart, and I didn't list just regular premium. It listed this, like, X-Nitro thing. And it's like, oh. I mean, I don't want putting weird crap into my 70-plus-year-old engine here that is going to be so unfamiliar to it that it might not work so uh and i don't want to get regular i want to get premium this time and i don't know what that is and there's no one here that i can ask so i'll just move on so i hopped back in started up drove to the nearby shoppers drug mart hopped in because i wanted to get a box to use to ship a whole bunch of 3d printed stuff to that nishara nerd as thanks for sending me that pyro mithra amiibo and apparently i couldn't buy that there it was after hours for for Canada Post that was in there, even though the shopper's drug mart was still open, they couldn't sell me the boxes. So I had to leave. Hopped in my truck, started up again just fine. Started perfectly fine. Drove over to a different gas station nearby. And it also only lists regular and this X Nitro stuff. And there was a guy in the gas station there, so I just asked him, like, what does that mean? Because I have an old engine, and I want to be careful what I'm putting in it. And he just said it's premium. It's like, all that means is a fancy way to say premium. And I was like, okay. So I filled it up. And it didn't start anymore. I, I, and it hasn't started since then once. I don't know if the fuel was weird or or what's going on there. I might get that neighbor mechanic friendo's help again and see what he thinks. But it just was not starting. But it was pretty close to home. And so my parents came along for a rescue, like which I'm really, really grateful for. So I have this old classic Dodge as Fargo. And my dad and his modern Dodge, <laughs> the 2019 one, we tied it to the back. We tied the front of my Fargo to the back of his truck, and he pulled me home with his hazard lights on while my mom was behind me with her hazard lights on, just going very slowly and literally just pulled me home. We got in the backyard, and it hasn't started since. I have since then a couple times attempted to start it, and it almost starts. Like, it sounds like it wants to. It goes vroom, 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 as I'm trying to start it. Like, it's almost firing up. But it doesn't. And while my dad and I were on a phone call while he was pulling me back home again, he said, like, try to start it here. Because apparently that's a common thing that people used to do with old vehicles was if it's struggling to start, have something else be pulling it. And then you have, like, the natural turning of the crankshaft in the engine. And then you can try to start off of that. And I tried to start off of that. And I didn't know the proper technique for that. I didn't know if I needed to have, like, clutching or if I had to ha hit the ignition pedal. I guess I misunderstood him because he told me afterwards that I could just have it in gear and then let out the clutch and it should start, that I didn't have to hit the starter. I was hitting the starter because I thought that it was necessary to start it, but I guess not. And it did actually briefly fire up when I was doing that. But the moment that I would put it into neutral or start to take my foot a decent bit more off the clutch and it would just die. It was very briefly running on the pull home. And that's the only time that it's ran since that breakdown. And even then, like, it wasn't running all that great since it would just immediately stall and die again. So, I mean, again, I could have just been doing it wrong. I never pull-starred a vehicle before. That was a first for me. But, yeah, so I came to Fragapalooza in my car. So that was something that I that I could ramble about there, I guess. Getting ready for something? <laughs> the sound effects as he's just moving his wrist here. over it. You like, the sound effects sound so much fancier than the actual I've animations the that he was doing. Chief engineer is developing a new weapon. So, yeah, that's why I didn't take my truck to Fragapalooza. And I... I don't know. But it will be a problem when it does. He's trying to flee Achaea. If he does want to escape, maybe we can convince him to help us defeat the Tempest. He's attending the shipbuilding symposium at the amphitheater here in Achaea. Guess I'll go to the symposium here. I can here. head over to the amphitheater now. There seems to be a discussion about a plan. 
a secret weapon for the Tempest. The chief I engineer was just talking about it. about it. I thought. Sounds easy enough. Unless it is related here, and that's what you're trying to imply. I am Poseidon's chosen. <laughs> sure. The chief engineer is amongst the attendees. Seek him out. What's with that blade? That blade means a lot to you. Where does it come from? I forged it myself. But it's more than a blade to me. It's a choice. It takes skill to get so close to a target. <laughs> That's the point. What do you know about the what Tempest? What do you know about the Tempest? She must have been planted by Amorgus. I'm not familiar with the Tempest, but I wouldn't put anything past Amorgus. He's Amorgus. only ever had one thing on his mind. I won't Last be able to stop thinking about it. I don't even think that it's a, that funny of a joke when nice. people say that. But just with how similar this is, I can't get it out of my what stupid head. What convinced you people, Darius? Uh, Natakis's heart is in the right place, and I want to encourage that. But the moment we're done, we're leaving the Greek world for good. Okay, I'll go find the chief engineer. Now and find the chief engineer. Okay, reach the amphitheater. Now, there's one more thing I was gonna say on. Oh yeah, I remember what I was gonna say on the subject of my truck. So, considering we've been dealing with this, trying to get it working, to no avail, always one thing after the other to make it not work. For 11 months now, and it is starting to get to the point that is genuinely, like, starting to hurt the motivation. Like, I... Because it keeps on feeling like it's never gonna get fixed. That's what it keeps on feeling like. My dad was talking about, like, maybe I should just try to get it taken into a shop and have it be worked on professionally by people that do that, like, as they're, as they're living. So, there's a place that does old vehicle inspections and service, like, here in Leduc, where Fragapalooza is taking place, called Tisher Automotive. Wow, you can see the stream there from the, from the stage reflecting off my microphone arm here. Because my microphone armor is black, but it's changing colors. Anyway, I just noticed that. I thought it was fun. Um, so when I head back home on Sunday from Fragapalooza, I might just stop in there and ask what kind of openings they have for appointments for service. And then if there's something for this year, then I'll get it slotted in, maybe. And then if I get it fixed before that point, then great, I can cancel the appointment. If I don't get it fixed, then I would probably just have it towed here, bite the bullet, and pay for those expenses. Have it done, and then... It can hopefully just be done and fixed. Yeah, is hopefully the case. Now there's something purple, but that's probably pretty obvious. Oh, they're playing Quiplash up the- oh. Hold on. So, invented the amphitheater to identify the chief engineer. Hi, it's not awesome, so it's just me running around here. Speak to you? Please leave me alone. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so I mean, like. Now? Hi. I'm pretty sure you can hear oh, me this now. is the one then. Alright. So, it's like, this the is the one. We are just gonna play some Quiplash for the next hour. Oh, jeez, the next hour. Are you guys in? I yeah? I, don't see I might. Alright, well, we have him here on the I, uh, screen. Chosen. You're uh, we're gonna play some Jackbox games for service. Triplash. Everybody should know how to do this. I played Triplash 2. I haven't played Triplash 3. First in, win. Fred sent me. So, when you guys are, uh, got, you got exactly two minutes. Join it. And we can help with that. Such freely okay. help often comes with a hidden cost. Not this time. I promise. Well, if the Tempest had sent you, I'd be dead by now. I need a way to defeat Oh my goodness, I... Like this might not have been the best idea, but I got into Quiplash. <laughs> well, I mean, uh... I'll pull it up here in a hot second. As well, I'll do. You're in the mirror! force me to complete it. Oh. We're talking about this weapon here, that might be important. Okay. You want me to start it? Um. No, don't start it yet. Okay. Let me pull up the. Him? Can I pull up the frag stream? I can't do it live. It would be with a little bit of delay. A whole bunch of people are joining the audience. Maybe I'll just. Screw it. Let's use the quick flash while we're doing this. Because it's funny. 
There. And then you can sort of see. There. <laughs> We're gonna play a bit flash while we play Assassin's Creed Odyssey. What's our not Oh, dude, that would probably not be a, that would be a way to get quickly banned from Fragapalooza, yeah, I think. Yeah. But most likely be the case. You watching this? You were out there. Well, I guess you gave right. games. That's I'm just gonna stream Assassin's Creed Odyssey and continue this playthrough oh, yeah. while I play Quick Flash. Cause join, buddy, this kind of breath exactly. Oh, I got a. Oh, okay, that's you. <laughs> but yeah, I've never played Quick Flash three. I've only played Quick Flash three. It's meant to oh, no, said enemy ships in oh yeah, he said start it. So yeah, you're good. All right, let's see it. Let's <laughs> just, just play two games at once. All right. All right. What do you know about the Tempest? I'm like half paying attention. Man, there's so much simulation all the time at Frag. All right. Yeah, if you want to pay attention to the game, anyone watching this, then feel free to. But I, I'm just getting through things while like half paying attention. <laughs> kind of what's going on here. All right. Answer two prompts. Let's um. Oh no! All right, defying the tempest is risky. All right, let's see here. All right, the one thing you should never put in a communal fridge, uh, and it has to be family friendly. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna say your frag up blue surprises. I don't know. I can't, I can't think of anything good. All right, hold on. Give me a sec here. A terrible Mother's Day gift. Um, I don't know. Can I do something that's like opposite? What would be something that you'd give to a dad? I don't know. Terrible Mother's Day gift. Oh, I can't think of anything good right now. My brain is also fried from doing stuff here for so long. Terrible Mother's Day gift. Um. What if I just like insult a game? What's a really, really bad game that everyone knows is bad? So uh, no, I can't think of anything. I I don't know what to uh what to say here. We were just talking about Call of Duty earlier. I could say that. <laughs> that's what I uh that's what I could do. Screw it. I can't think of anything. I can't even spell it right. There we go. Submit. All right. Um, I could use the help. Okay. I did my I did my things. All right. Let's see here. So, how do I get the plans? Okay. Okay. It's immediately starting out with that. Hold on. The plans are written in a code. I'm not winning this one. That's not happening. I... I could not think of a, a good thing there. Oh, hi, you're just chilling there. Yeah, don't worry, it's totally sorted here. No worries. He's gone. Wow, I actually did better than I thought I would. If you guys can you can't... Alright, open my map to find my objective. We're also okay. Feed in Zone Blue and Dragapalooza. Who's Tom Jr.? What? Choose your favorite. The heck? All right, let's see here. So, Akai is currently in the Temple of Artemis in Patrai. What? It's in Akaya. Currently in Temple of Artemis. Is that like an area here? I don't see it here. I don't know where that is. In Patrai. Is Patrai the name of an area? It sure doesn't look like here. Next one up. Oh the god. This player, the oh, I don't know who this person is. This person sucks. Not a super boring white boy name. I don't know, man. So is this the oh, Patrai. Currently in the Temple of Artemis in Patrai. So Temple of Artemis here. Like, what? Is one of these a Temple of Artemis? It's gotta be like this, right? I don't know. Oh, I'm close to my target. Uh oh. 
by not getting a hug from Victor? Bring your ass. All right, I guess I didn't really need a market. It. It's right here. There we go. Okay. Um. What is it trying to tell me here? If I fast travel, how much time is I gonna save? Any? No. Um. Well, we're not so different, you and I. I'm gonna adjust this camera slightly. There. Even though it still looks kind of sideways. All right. Do I still have my custom marker? Yeah, I do. I need to take it off. All right. Quick flash because Pennywise got so much more. I didn't. Oh my goodness! I did set a new thing. All right. Well, I mean, uh. That's that's not a, the second one isn't a gift. Like that's not not a thing that you give as a gift. That's not how it works. Like what? At least mine makes sense, right? I don't know. Well, okay. Okay, finally acquired the blueprints from the Fleet Commander. So like. Let's see. Um. Oof. What? <laughs> All right. Phone a friend, maybe. Oh, phone a friend quickly! Oh my goodness, I phone a friend just in time. Nice. Ready to die. Oh my god. Um, please. Okay, so just like. <laughs> Okay, what's this? Um, nuclear Desator? Desator? Is that a typo? I assume that's a typo. Right? That actually did a lot more damage too than I was expecting. Okay, do this now. And then I have to loot you, right? But I can just do that quickly. It's not like I'm gonna have to hold it, right? You wait. There we go. There we go. Perfect. All right. Well, that was certainly something, wasn't it? I am probably chatting to them while I'm typing in the prompts for the next thing, right? You wink. I, mean, I wouldn't have so many mercenaries coming after me if I didn't do that all the time. What? Uh oh. Only he could decipher the weapons. Oh. You need to be anonymous. Am I not? Oh, because they're still looking for me up there. I guess he died. Okay. Let's see here. I've got to be anonymous. For the sake of accuracy, the Natural History Museum had to remove the blank exhibit. Um. For the sake of accuracy, the Natural History Museum had to remove the. Let's say the moon landing exhibit. Imply the moon landing was faked. Uh, what did Goldilocks say when she took her date home? Oh god. What do. Am I not anonymous? Oh, okay. I am here. I can turn this off for now. What did Goldilocks say when she took her date home? Uh, I'm playing Quiplash. Leave me alone. Oh, Sam. Hmm. Look who decided to show up just in time. Kill them. And I'm gonna keep it family friendly, so I'm just gonna say you already know. Okay. I was just finishing my prompt. Oh god. Okay. I um Okay. Let's just um oh my goodness. Let's do this. Megacreon of the auto the uh, no the Autobots, Decepticons. I don't remember how Transformers works. Let's... They're decently tanky. Oh, but he does so much damage, huh? Okay. Let's do this now. Okay. Hey, nobody back. Is there someone else still? Nope. All right, may as well switch back to this then. But I may as well do, right? Okay. Let's see here. No. Please, 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 please. Uh, what? 
Such a perk of being a magician's assistant, you can make crappy X disappear. Knowing what happened to the missing people like the crappy X. Okay, I don't know here. Please heal. Please heal. That was great. Oh my god. That was like a Dark Souls 2 moment there for a second. Okay, confirm kill, I guess. Oh my goodness gracious. Stab. Okay, talk to who? I defeated a guy. Okay, here we go. <laughs> um, please. Come on. Let's see it. Come on. What's it gonna be? Really? Oh, wow. Come on, that was fun. Alright, let's quick save from time to time, I guess. Okay. What? <laughs> what? What's the needle point? Was that the name of a real ship or something? Is he gonna live? Is he okay? The tempest is more shrewd and careful than we expected. Uh, Who's the only person that voted for Fragapalooza? We should watch oh, the plus the audience. Might be in danger too. Let's see the next okay. Let's take a look at the plans. Something that should never be decided by a coin toss. Back to the okay. Shows, then. Marriage president. Oh my god. I mean, it basically already is. Yeah. Oh, you have a new quest for me. I sure don't care, though. Wait, what? Where am I going? Your quest, call before the storm. And talk to... Oh, yeah, it is a thing over here. It is indeed. Okay. Let's see here. Up we go. I wonder how the final round works with Quiplash 3, because I've only ever played 2. What? What? Um, how about, where am I going again? Oh, over here. Let's, let's go over this way. Uh, let's meet with what's-his-face. Should I wait until these are through before I chat with him? We're just wrapping up the quest, right? So I mean like... No. Okay. Who do you think would have won? Um, I can handle myself. Okay. I didn't want to do like anything too shocking because, like, family venue and stuff here. Also, what is this Discord ping I have? Fraga Blues in Discord is it an ad? Everyone? Yeah, it is. You no, know, if I'm out Jackbox. Wow. Well, I mean, uh, I guess I'll just start doing more shocking things because apparently it's allowed. What? Sure, I don't know, man. Whoops. Oh, because I'm... Whoops. This one here. So I was still clicked on OBS when I was using my controller. Whatever, let's just talk here. We've done everything we set out to. Now. To get the stranded people out of Ashea. Okay. The tempest is on I guess I use the thing for a thumbnail, I guess. Oh, the lag. Yeah, that's right. What? Um. Develop a stuttering problem. Develop a stuttering problem narrate. <laughs> I don't know, man. Um, I hope you're right. Sure, I hope so. Okay. Let's do it. So we're gonna do like the final boss of episode two here, right? Is the case. So. Yeah, there's a lot of other sounds going on here. It might be kind of hard to hear in the game. But... Thank goodness again for subtitles. And after 200 parts, who cares about the story anymore? You must go. I doubt anyone would actually watch my series through to this point and still be really wanting to know what goes on with the story. So, like, whatever, who cares? <laughs> so, I mean, you know. So. So. 
Responses. We'll need what? To stay until then. Three separate responses. What now? So what am I doing? The three things you'll probably never hold in your hand. I have to say. Um. Let's just do something that's just like very real. Um. All right, Jackbox. I just say like house deed. The last round for this one. Um, do one more quick flash. Please let new players in for the next. I round. don't know. And then I'm gonna run a poll in Discord for the next game. I don't know. A stable job that doesn't really make much sense because you don't hold it in your hand. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Well, you probably never hold in your hand. Um. Mm hmm. <laughs> Let's do this. Okay, well, let's do that. Um, I'll meet you there. It's probably easier. I don't know. Okay. Running out. Sure. Let's do that. Okay, meet Mr. Nudo in the place. Oh my god, that's far. I can fast travel, right? Okay, um... Where is this at? I don't know where this is at. Let's see here. There's a Charizard. So I mean... Oh, and then it's just like versus things until it's one person left, I guess. So what's going on here? Where is this icon? Can I find it in the meantime? Where the heck is it? What direction is it, first and foremost? It is kind of southwest. Oh, it's not super far. I can fast travel here. Oh, man. Oh, heck yeah! Skill issue! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so people get different things. Um. <laughs> um. I object. They both have a birth. And they both have a marriage. So there's just Taco Bell or family reunion. Reunion. Looking for the person that typed right, and it's also funny for Taco Bell. I'll run over this way in game in the meantime. That's what I'll do. Here. Oh, who's suspicious of me? For what reason? Okay, there we go. That's the one that I voted for too. Okay. What? Okay. <laughs> um. What? Decisions, decisions. <laughs> I mean, I'm voting for the first one. Okay. Look, wall. Look, Quiplash. Look over there, she points. This is about to be final battle. Am I about to do the final battle of episode two here while I'm in the middle of playing Quiplash? Is that going to be what's going on here? Which is pretty hilarious. You know. He does that sometimes. All right. All right, so it was pretty even. Oh, but then plus audience, it was the left one. So I mean, okay, never date someone who does any of the following. There, Mr. Fragapalooza doesn't let me go to Fraga. Um, I don't know who Hallie is. I don't know what Sphincter is. Doesn't hug Sphincter. Like, what does that mean? I'm gonna say, just let me go to Fraga. That's what I'm gonna do there. Uh, it's beautiful. Yeah, look, that quiplash that we're staring up at. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> the thing that we're getting distracted by here. Isn't it just gorgeous? I must say. Alright. Okay, so it was the right one. 55, the audience brought closer. probably keep running. As always. Okay. 
Okay, Hold on. At least there's wine. Oh, the, my camera's not going to focus in. I... I definitely got in first. You don't need to see it. That was definitely me. My camera didn't focus in. But that's okay. You can take my word for it. All right. Congratulations, Nicholas, on your win. Wish. Okay, we're going to do one more round of this. Also, the poll is currently running. In okay, so he's going to be listening over here, blood. I guess. If I can get new players for the new round, that would be really helpful. Okay, like new I'll players for the new round. Blood. I'll back out then. And, uh, yeah. All right, now I'll mute the microphone so we can actually listen to this. And, uh, it's hard to make friends for people like us. Living on the move as we do. Oh. We've met each other. To our friendship. To our friendship. <laughs> Malaka. Malaka. This reminds me of when we met in Macedonia. We ate boar beneath the stars. It was the first time in a long time that I felt home. I haven't felt that since. Until tonight. Then let's make the most of it. <laughs>